hi guys welcome to snake nook in this video i'm going to share with you all how i set up an activity station or an enrichment station just using some cardboard boxes that's right cardboard boxes are not just for cats you can use them to entertain your snakes mm -hmm. So setting up an activity station using cardboard boxes is actually quite easy. I had these clean boxes that I was going to recycle anyway, but I noticed that they could be set up as an activity center for my snakes. And they already came with some openings, so I did not have to cut holes into them. All I did was just lay them out in an open area and my snakes have been enjoying them. So here you can see my albino pinstripe. She is just curious about everything. She's been checking out every part of the box, the setup. And so it's good to keep your snakes entertained. It's good to have some type of mental stimulation for them. My snakes live in tough vivariums, but they don't stay there all day, every day. I do take them out and interact with them. And then I also have something like this available for them. So sometimes it's not a cardboard box, but in this case, I was able to repurpose these boxes. And oh, far back there, we can see my pastel pinstripe. He has decided he's gonna check out the cat toys and accessories. That seems to be a little more interesting for him at this time, but my albino, is still checking out the boxes. So many people keep ball pythons as pets and here I have two of my males, a pinstripe and a normal and they're also checking out this activity station. And so by the time I brought out my two big girls, these are uh, my two female ball pythons, a pinstripe and a pastel, they are sub-adults. But by the time they came out, I wanted to make sure that the boxes had been reinforced with duct tape because they are stronger and they can push the boxes out of place. So I went ahead and secured them for them a little bit there with some duct tape. And if you hear the occasional squawking like that, that is my Pied Piper, he's a cockatiel. Oh, here are my boas, and they could definitely enjoy some time on these boxes as well. So I put away my big girls, and I brought out these little guys. They also had a lot of fun. So snakes need to be stimulated mentally. Um, you want to keep their brains from going atrophy, and so always providing a little something different for them to do, such as just using some simple cardboard boxes that aren't going to cost you any money. So I hope that you have enjoyed the idea of using cardboard boxes to build an activity station for your snakes. It won't cost you anything, maybe just a little bit of time to set up the boxes and maybe reinforce them. But this is definitely a good way to keep your snakes thinking, learning, and enjoying their environment. Thank y'all so much for watching. Y'all have a good one. Bye.